Hey everyone, another DIY project today. You want to make something that helps ease muscle cramps, soothes muscle tension, helps relieve pain and joint inflammation, and puts back an essential mineral into your body. Stay tuned, and I'll show you how. Okay, to get started, we need to take three tablespoons of the spring or distilled water. And three. What we need to do is heat it up. So I've heated my water, and now what I need to do is I need to add half a cup of the magnesium flakes because you want to dissolve them. Now it's going to take a good five minutes of continuous stirring before these uh, magnesium flakes are dissolved in the uh, warm hot water. In a separate bowl you're going to add your quarter cup of coconut oil. two tablespoons of emulsifying wax and I'll put that in the description below where I get it and you're going to need three tablespoons of unrefined shea butter so next what you're going to do I'm going to throw this in the microwave, but do it slow, uh, like 30 second bursts, until it's completely melted. Okay, well my oils are nice and melted. My emulsifying wax is melted. Okay, so now that uh, my uh, oil mixture and emulsifying wax is cooled somewhat, I'm going to pour it into my uh, magnesium water. do is we're going to stick blend it. Now you guys can use uh, a blender hand mixer with uh, with a whisking uh, end on it, uh, attachment on it, and uh, do it in short bursts so this speeds it up using a stick blender. And this is what is great about the emulsifying wax, is it helps incorporate the water and the oils, mix, letting it mix together, and that's what the emulsifying wax is for. Emulsifying wax is what gives you that, that lotion look and feel, and it'll stay together, it won't separate. As you can tell, this is nice and thick now. See how it drops off of my uh, stick blender. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that down and I'm going to just clean off my blender. can see how nice nice and thick that is so and you want it sort of like runny like this because it will thicken up once it cools and last but not least we're gonna add the essential oil now me 
as you can see I'm using uh, lavender essential oil because it's really great for uh, to relax your body it's a great aromatherapy so I'm going to add about 10 to uh, 20 drops of this but because lavender oil is so potent in smell I'm only probably going to do 10 oh and it already smells great and this isn't this is natural this isn't all natural there's no uh, like fragrance oils or anything. This is all uh, essential oils that I put in here. But you can use any type of essential oil that you want. Uh, me, I use this more therapeutic because lavender is, uh, is another uh, essential oil that helps to relax. And that's what I want this magnesium lotion to be like. So, mm, it smells good. So then I just go take my little little jars here just a little one you can get any kind of container and I just pour it in now there's no need because this is for home use there's no need to put in uh, any preservative or anything like that and you just put it on the affected areas rub it in and it'll it'll saturate leave it on for at least 20 to 30 minutes so it gives it time to uh, soak in and saturate the skin and you'll find it really helps uh, I use this um, for uh, my husband has uh, leg cramps uh, he suffers at night and when I do put this on uh, it seems to uh, alleviate uh, quite a quite a significant amount of the symptoms that, uh, from the uh, cramping and I use this stuff on my restless legs and it helps me settle down at night so yeah that's what you do is you jar it up put the lid on and leave it in the fridge and it'll last you for quite a while so just leave it in there and use it as needed Thanks for watching.